this is the simulating model of that solar pv fed build its motor for air cooler application so in this model first you need to initialize the irradiation so here you can change the irradiation so just click this block here already I created that uh, irradiation level from 0 to 0 0.5 the irradiation fixed at uh, 1000 watts per meter square when 0.5 to once again the irradiation change from 1000 to 400 and then from 1 to 2 the irradiation maintained at 400 from 2 to 3 the irradiation maintained at 700 and then 3 to 4 the irradiation maintained at 1000 so this is the signal field uh, builder for that uh, irradiation so we can uh, i can change the irradiation also so we can fix irradiation constant and then you can take the reading so here you can see that so you can fix uh, irradiation constant by using this block you can change the irradiation 1800 900 whatever may be in between 200 to 1000 and then you can change this manual switch whether you want a variable irradiation or fixed irradiation so you can change this one and then you can take the reading here i am uh, using 1000 watts pv panel so this is a pv panel data so single panel power rating is 250 and then i am going to use uh, 4, 4 PV panel in series so 4 into 250 so the total power is 1000 watts and voltage uh, maximum maximum power the voltage in maximum power point is 30.5 so the voltage for the overall PV panels is around 4 into 30 so it's around 120 volt so this is the short circuit current the current at maximum power point this is open circuit voltage so here you can uh, generate that uh, PV IV cat 6 ok so this is a PV IV cat 6 of that uh, consider a PV panel ok so this is IV cat 6 so this, this is PV cat 6 so we can uh, take that uh, details from here ok just you have to click this one and then uh, take this click that blot so we will get this window ok so this IVPV for a different irradiation condition next here I am using bug boost converter so already you know the bug boost output terminal is uh, reversed so that's why I am going to connect here so this is plus this is minus so I am going to connect here so that we will dis, uh, voltage source inverter right and then uh, the converter bug boost converter controlled by means of that uh, mpp diagram so it receive two inputs okay so it receive two inputs ipv pv so it going to be process via p and algorithm so it provide the duty cycle here okay so this duty cycle is processed via Epidemic generator, so it going to be controlled that the uh, MOSFET of that uh, bug boost converter to extract the maximum power from the PV panel. Okay, so next uh, I am going to measure PV details that mean I am going to measure PV voltage and then uh, PV current and PV power. So, so this scope used to for measuring that irradiation, PV voltage, and PV power. And then this scope used to for measuring the uh, bug boost voltage, current, and power. So, this is uh, a build is motor used for water pump. So, here I am going to measure the back EMF, and then that mean uh, hall sensor output, and then going to be convert to EMF and then emf going to be used for generating gate pulse for that 
voltage system motor to control the release motor and then i'm going to take feedback of the speed and to convert to torque and then given to that uh, bldc motor the same way i'm going to use the same detail that mean uh, i'm going to use voltage source inverter bldc motor and then the hall sensor output is measured and then going to be converted to emf and then emf going to be generated gate signal so here you can see that so this is the conversion block for that hall sensor input to the back emf okay so here you can see the table for that conversion hall sensor to back emf calculation so here you can see that the back emf going to be converted to getting pulse for that voltage source inverter so this is a table used for converting that back emf into switching pulse for that voltage source inverter So here we can see that uh, uh, reading of that uh, solar water pump. So this is stator current of the BLDs motor. So this is a back aim of electromotive force that means back aim of that uh, BLDs motor used for water pump. So this is speed of that uh, water pump. So this is the torque of that uh, that water pump. So here we can see that. So this is uh, uh, speed of that uh, flowing van. Uh, sorry stator current of the uh, blower fan and then uh, emf of the blower fan and the speed of the blower fan this is the torque of the blower fan okay so here i fixing that uh, varying irradiation addition so irradiation uh, uh, duty uh, increasing and uh, decreasing irradiation you can see that here that uh, irradiation maintained at thousand so for that <coughs> here the maximum power extracted from that solar PV okay for 1000 watts per meter square the maximum power of that panel is 1000 watts and the radiation decreases from this point to this point to 400 watts so because of that uh, the power of that PV is uh, decreases from this point to this point how to extract the maximum power so do, uh, during that 400 watts per meter square the maximum power is 400 so here that uh, irradiation change from 400 to 700 so you can see that the shifting of power from this point to this point because of change in irradiation 400 watts per meter square to 700 watts per meter square so here uh, the power uh, radiation change from uh, 700 to 1000 so once again that uh, power pv power is extracted so that mean uh, level is increased from this point to this point that mean it extracts the maximum power from the two pv panel so this is a variation of that pv voltage so next so this is bug boost converter output voltage because of change in irradiation condition so this is bug boost current output current so this is bug boost output power because of change in irradiation condition here you can see that so this is a variation of uh, stator current because of change in the radiation so this is a variation of uh, emf because of change in the radiation this is speed variation and torque variation okay for the water pump so this is for uh, that uh, blue fan right okay so next i'm going to fix the irradiation constant here i am going to make uh, steady state that mean irradiation at a steady state point and then i am going to simulate this one so we will get the answer first time okay so this is a variation of irradiation and so that mean irradiation here maintain at constant value thousand watts per meter square so this is a variation of pv voltage and pv power when irradiation 1000 watts per meter square, you should extract the maximum power around 1000 watts. Now you can see that the power is extracted here. So after some time, it reached to 1000 watts. Yeah. Here you can see that <coughs> the power level of the PV for increased. Yeah. Okay. So So it reaches the maximum power. Uh, 
ఒక థౌసండ్ వాట్స్ మనకి తెచ్చుకొని మ్యాక్సిమం పవర్ ఇస్ ఈస్ థౌసండ్ వాట్స్ రైట్ పీవీ ప్యానల్ షుడ్ సప్లై థౌసండ్ వాట్స్ ఫ్రమ్ దట్ ప్యానల్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ దట్ పీ అండ్ ఎంబీపీటీఎల్ గారుదాం సో హియర్ ఆల్సో యూ కెన్ సీ దట్ సో దిస్ బగ్ బూస్ట్ కన్వర్టర్ వోల్టేజ్ సో దిస్ బగ్ బూస్ట్ అవుట్పుట్ కరెంట్ సో దిస్ ఈస్ బగ్ బూస్ట్ అవుట్పుట్ పవర్ next time i'm going to change the irradiation to 500 and then we check the result of that one because of that uh, 500 watts per meter square okay so on the maximum power should be extracted from the pv panel equal to 500 watts because of that 500 watts per meter square so we will check that extraction of that pv power from the panel so now you can see that the pv power is increasing this goes to 500 watts okay so for that uh, 500 watts uh, watts per meter square radiation also the power is extracted nearer to that uh, maximum power because of that p and algorithm so this is a variation of that bug boost output voltage and current and the power of that bug boost converter next one is this is variation of that uh, stator current emf speed and torque of that uh, water pump so this variation of uh, blower fan uh, stator current emf speed and uh, torque okay so by the way we can uh, you can vary this uh, irradiation and you can take the different readings okay and also if you want to know this change in irradiation condition so you can change this manual switch just give it a double click and then you can change any direction so and then you can take the reading thank you